Hello. How to remove a Burke line back. In addition to making motion upholstery designed for comfort, furniture manufacturer Burke line makes its products easy to disassemble and move. Most of the reclining products feature easily removable seat backs. Though many recliner brands feature removable backs, Burke line offers it on sofas and sectionals as well. The multi-seat pieces feature individual seat backs, allowing you to recline or remove each section independently from the rest. Removing the back makes the furniture piece more compact for crating, shipping or storage. It also makes spot cleaning easier, because you can rest the seat back on a flat surface. Instructions 1. Grasp the bottom edge of the fabric or leather back panel, which you'll find near the bottom of the chair. Pull the panel toward you to release the hook and loop tape strip holding it in place. Fold the loose bottom edge of the back panel toward the top of the piece, and secure it to the fasteners at the top corners. 2. Slide your hands along the sides of the exposed back area, where the back meets the seat. Stop when you feel the release latches. Press the latches simultaneously. 3. Lift the back of the piece straight up and off in one smooth motion. Lift until the back is completely detached from the seat. Rest the detached back face down on the arms of the chair, or the seat of the sofa, to box or move the piece. Tips and warnings. The back slides on and off of the piece via plates that serve as a track. If you don't lift the back from the seat in a single motion, the back could get stuck on the plates. Never lift one side at a time. Recruit a friend to help if you can't lift the back on your own. Resources Berkline, Privacy Policy Thanks for watching.